Ross and ground folks what we have here is another video this is a daycare this property has two systems here two furnaces in the basement um i believe last fall we did a heat maintenance here but it wasn't anything major they got two 90 percenters downstairs but guys the reason why i'm making this video this is a no ac complaint um the customer said that the ac unit froze up one is working fine but the other one is, is something's definitely going on it's called it's causing the unit to freeze up Everything downstairs checked out fine. Airflow is fine. Filter is good. But guys, I just hooked my gauges up here. And by the way, this is a Goodman um, 13 series unit. I want to say this thing is under 10 years old. So this thing is already four tonight. But guys, pay attention to the numbers here. We're right. We're slightly below a 40 degree coil. But look at look at my hot side. That is no bueno. And guys, just as a point of reference, just so you know, I mean, we're in Philadelphia, but it's only an 85 degree day and it's not humid. So like, I expect there to be humidity downstairs, but there's this isn't like a, a, a very, very extremely humid day. So I'm expecting decent hair pressure, like a decent load in this unit, but being at 400 and you see how my hot side is hunting, hunting means the numbers are jumping up and down. But based on how my hot side is, it's safe to assume that, that this unit has non-condensables. Non-condensable means that there's moisture or there's air in the system. And the best explanation for that is whenever they installed this unit, they didn't put, they might have pressurized it, but they didn't put this unit in a vacuum. And guys, the purpose of the vacuum pump, when you install um, a system or if you're making a refrigerant related repair, the point of that vacuum pump is to remove moisture from the system so you don't have what, I, what we're seeing right now, guys. And Based on my numbers, as you can see, at a 32 degree coil, this thing is gonna to start to freeze up. I think that this unit was hunting so bad that it put my low side probably at freezing point, and that is what caused this unit to freeze up. So, guys, at this point, I'll probably recommend doing a leak check and also pull it, putting this thing in a vacuum. And I'm not even sure if there's a filter dryer on this unit. It might be one at the evac coil downstairs, but I'll have to double check that, but guys, yeah. As far as high side, at the most, I want to see about 330. If my high side is above 330, at that point, I got to step back and look at the situation, make sure that they got the right type of refrigerant in the system. We have to assume that this is 410A in the system because that's what the nameplate calls for, but guys, assuming that that's okay, they didn't put in something different, it's safe to assume that this unit has non-condensables, and that's why my high side is see that it's going to it's going to go below 400 and then it's going to go back up but that's the reason that my hot side is, is hunting like that but i definitely wouldn't trust that this unit ever ever ran that well i think that they might have had issues for a while but like i said guys they have two units here so and that's the that's the i want to i'm not going to say the downside but guys that's a tricky thing if you got a customer with two systems one unit can be working well but you got one that's not really up to par this might not be a, a, a obvious issue because they still have AC from another unit. But guys, they definitely noticed that, you know, it definitely didn't feel that cool. And that's why they called us out. But like based on these numbers, guys, I definitely think it's best to pull a pull a vacuum. Or first pressurize the system, make sure there's no leaks. And if this unit holds pressure, then we'll slap a, a filter dryer onto it and definitely put this thing in a vacuum. There you guys have it. Let me know what you think about this. And I'm going to shoot down there, speak with the customer, and we'll get this, get this squared away. Peace out. See you.